this is my version of imposter syndrome. And I, Justin Costelli sent this to me after hearing the story, which is one of the kindest gifts I've ever received, to be honest, because now I get to see Mr. Burns every day. And my good days are when Mr. Burns shows up, right? My good days are when Mr. Burns shows up and is like, what's going on in here? And I can say, hey, I'm so glad you're here, right? It means we're about to do something cool. Like you, you can you you can hang out, but you just can't you just can't drive. That's what Elizabeth Gilbert says. Like fear can come on the trip, it just can't drive. And to me, that that transmute, transmutation of it, instead of like kick fear in the teeth, no fear, get rid of imposter syndrome. I don't like that language. Fear's been really helpful to me. It saved my life recently. Right. So I don't want to kick it in the teeth. Instead, I want to say, hey, brother, I'm just using the keyboard, like everything's fine. There's no lions, but I'm really glad you're here because every time I've done something cool, you've been here. Every single time, you know, the birth of every one of my kids. You know what I'm saying? Like, of course I was scared. My marriage, every mountain bike race I've done, every book, this call, this morning before this call, I was like, what, uh, do I really have anything valuable? I still don't know the answer to that, but I don't really care because I, I, I've, I've felt this feeling before. So my, if I could go so far as to say like gift, I'd love to send you all your own version of Mr. Burns. Greetings, Carl Richards here. And the clip you just watched was from the monthly chapter meeting of the Society of Advice. It's a thing we called the membership. And we got crazy with the sketches this time. What we explored this month was how to close the gap between our own personal values and our actions. You've got this thing you want to do. You desperately want to see it in the world. This thing that you care deeply about. And yet, you're not doing it. How do we close that gap? That's what we talked about. It's for real financial advisors who want to do work that matters and make sure it gets out in the world. And we would love to have you. For more information on the Society of Advice membership program, just make sure you grab the link below.